Oh, yeah, that was Holy f Holy sh**. <laughs> that that's, dude, that look how that's big a, that is. That's a four or six footer. Holy sh**. Cool. So he's maybe he's feeding now because he's seeing sh** going on. Dude, stay away from the bank. Holy sh**. And they get a lot bigger. <laughs> oh. Cool. He don't care either. No. That's awesome. You have to keep an eye on him, man. So we are in St. Augustine and fishing a pond I haven't fished in two years. Uh, me and my buddy came back down this time and uh, we're trying it out at the same pond. Um, I had previous videos where I caught some pretty damn nice snook. I don't even know what they were at the time. And we're gonna try it out today, hopefully catch some fish. We're going through like an extreme cold front right now. <laughs> we were in Southern Florida, Fort Lauderdale, and it was like 90 degrees uh, in December. And uh, now it is about mid 50s today. Um, at least this morning, hopefully it warms up a little bit. I don't know if these snook are still going to be active. Hopefully we can get something, some snook, some largemouth. So uh, right now I'm uh, casting a Brendan Miller swim bait and my buddy is throwing a uh, lipless crank bait. We'll see what we can do today. Hopefully we can catch something. Oh, yep. The water looks lower. I think, yeah, it does look lower here now. Because if this is where you were fishing, I think the water level was at the shore level. Yeah, it was higher up. You were kind of dragging them onto shore. Got my nose running and everything. What the hell's going on? I got my wish, and now you're crying, right? Now you're thinking, man, I was going to Florida to warm up. What the? F A stick. Oh, there it is. I bet you catch them. Yeah. Oh, I've seen them on. I don't know how you catch them. That's how they catch them. Yeah. Hey, there he is. He's gonna jump right on shore. They do eat them in some places, but they're not. They're not good. <laughs> they're not good, huh? There we go. There we go. Oh boy. I think I got a snook. Or a big ass bass. Not sure. What is it? Oh, it's like a redfish or something. What the hell? There we go. I don't know what it is, but I think it's a redfish. Really not sure. Completely tangled up here. Sweet. I don't know what it is. Got a new fish off the uh, 3D printed lipless crankbait. Another new fish out of the St. Augustine pond. We'll get them back here. Pretty cool. No idea. Redfish? My best guess. Just, uh, just, just about nightfall here. Probably got about an hour, another hour to cast. I'll get this guy unhooked and we'll get him back in. It's been pretty slow here lately. Casting, been casting quite a bit with uh, no luck, no bass, no snook. And then uh, latched onto this guy. Fought pretty good. Wasn't sure if I was gonna get him in. Whoop, 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 whoop. Oh, there we go. Sweet. All right, here we go. We'll get him back in. See you, dude. Sun's going down, the, the lights on the palm trees lit up. That's, that's freaking amazing. Did I mention I turned 30 today? 30 freaking years old, that is nuts.
Two panels of the bell on I guess you need them on the home just to telephone Hot to come on each and every night To see she was and if the kid was all Plenty of freaking mullet jumping. They don't seem to be affected by the cold. For how chilly it was yesterday, they were they were going at it. All right, they'll do it. Got the redfish, at least. Get all packed up here and we'll uh, be taking off. So if you guys live in the area, St. Augustine, or are visiting, if you can figure out where this, uh, where this pond is, I am leaving a pile of swim baits here for, uh, for you guys to try out if you can find them. Leave them right on this park bench. I like this one because it's flatter. You're not like going straight out. 